all right if you want to find out this given series is arithmetic or geometric to do that first we have to understand what is the mean of arithmetic progression and what is the mean of geometric progression in arithmetic progression if you see that the uh, example of or uh, the standard form arithmetic progression will be given as a e plus d e plus 2d here if you if you do if you find out the difference between two secured two continuous number so what a plus d minus a so you find out the d again if you the second term uh, third term and the second term so it will give you a plus 2d minus a minus d again it will give you d so you see that the difference between each sequential number is the same as a d so if this is a condition we satisfy then the given series is what is arithmetic progression series to find out our given series is arithmetic series or not we take the question 2 1 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 4 uh, to answer solve this one first we take this one and this one so 1 minus 2 is going to give you minus 1 all right and 1 by 2 minus 1 so 1 by 2 minus 1 is going to give you minus 1 by 2 the third condition is we have to find out 1 by 4 minus 1 by 2 which is going to give you It's going to give you minus one by two. So here you see that the difference between the one, the first two terms is minus one, and this one is minus one by two and minus one by two. So it's this that the whole thing is not arithmetic progression. But you can say that the continuous these terms are maybe in arithmetic progression. Okay, that the whole sequence is not in arithmetic progression. In the second term, if we want to find out is that given series in a geometric progression or not, what we can do that the a r divided by a is always give you r. Same time, if you take a r square divided by a r, which is again give you the r. So this one is a r square over here. So if you know in a geometric progression, you can see that if you divide the two sequential number, so it will give you the same number at every time. See that this one given as a geometric progression or not? What we can do that we take the second term, divide it with the first term. The answer is one by two. Is it? In the second term, we can do one by two. Divide it by one. So sorry, divide it by one. So it's going to give you one by two again. Again, in the third condition, we we take as one by four. Divide it with a one by two. So it is again going to give you one by two. So you see that in each term, the the answer is will be remain same. So we can say that it will be the GP, is it? So our answer for this one is the answer is geometric progression. All right thank you ask more questions to us we are ready to help.